Okay, so Viper for Android is one of the things which most of the users use on their devices and this is one of the best ever audio equalizer. If you want to try it out on your device, you can. I tried, I tested, it's working fine. Viper for Android FX which is working fine on Android version 11 right now. It comes with all those presets which I will share with you in this video. So stay tuned and make sure to watch this video till the end. It's actually working quite good as you can see driver status, it's enabled. It's just a magic module through which which you can install this wiper for android right now on your device it's almost like dolby atmos but most of the users don't like dolby atmos they want to use wiper for android so wiper fx is just one of those things if you want to try it out you can give it a try in this video i will tell you a lot of things about this thing first of all it's compatible with almost all the devices and yes i have tested it i i tested it on redmi note 8 i tested it on me tool device i also tested it on my redmi note 10 pro all of these devices have this thing working the thing is you make sure you have a good custom room and of course it should work on other devices also i'm not sure but you can give it a try it's just a simple magic module if it is working for you it's great if it is still not working for you bad luck and you can simply give it a try with other modules and you can try out other devices and a lot more things in the terms of features of course Viper FX is one of those audio equalizers out there which comes with very interesting features. A good kind of audio experience if you want on your Android, you must definitely install Viper FX. It comes with all these things, a headset you can customize, you can customize the sound or sorry speaker, headset, Bluetooth and a USB. These are some options and in the terms of things, settings which you need to do, it depends upon user preference is what a user likes. So it all depends upon you. I'm not going to share with you that thing but these are some options you get here FET compressor playback gain control and if you are a music lover you will definitely use Viper FX a lot of the users always use Viper FX on their devices and like if you also you can give it a try if you click here for example if I go here like this sorry for this once again click here and then if I click here once again like this I'll see all these presets these are already available already included but you can create your own custom preset also so so if you have any good preset you can share with me on telegram i'll definitely share with you uh, I, I will definitely share your preset with this audience but yes if you don't have you can give it a try these presets are quite good enough you can try out a lot of presets are already available you can create your own preset also you can also import other presets from the users which who are using this viper fx on their devices these are some interesting things about viper fx which i just wanted to let you know so if you want to install it as i previously mentioned it's just a magic mod this is the Viper FX Android and of course all the credits goes to its developer who made it possible to run it on your devices. This is Viper FX Android is a mode version of Viper for Android that provides a better sound experience with several options to make it your own. And yes, it's actually a moded Viper for Android. It's not actually from official which you can install from your custom recovery, sorry from Magisk inbuilt. And yes, I have uninstalled it on my device to show you that how it should work and just ignore these errors. These are in a custom room, so just ignore them. It will just go away like this. And okay, this is the file where you simply click on install from storage, install it as a Magisk module. The file link is in the description which should be around approximately 27 MB, Viper, APK and presets, everything is already included in this one. So simply click this, It will you will see these kind of logs. It will take some bit of seconds and after those, you will be able to use it on your device. It looks quite good, quite interesting if you want to install this. Everything I've already shown you till now, this is all from all these things. As you can see, if it will be installed successfully, you'll be able to reboot your device and it should work and if you're getting any kind of errors or boot loop issues make sure to watch the boot loop fix video this is all thanks for watching goodbye don't forget to like and share this video if you're new here don't forget to subscribe me goodbye have a nice day over the edge feel like i'm floating through the air